Hello, today's devotional can be found in the Topical Guide under Kindness in reference to Doctrine and Covenants, section 4, verse 6. Remember faith, virtue, brotherly kindness. Okay, so not everybody is going to respond well to being treated as if they are family. Not even everybody's family is going to be respo responsive to being treated well. Some families aren't built that way. Some families are rather dysfunctional, and that's nobody's fault. It's what it is. People make choices that contribute to the dysfunction of families, and that's what it is, and we can't do anything about that. All we can do is focus on how we personally treat others, even if we are treated badly. Because it takes a lot of faith to treat others nicely if we are treated badly even if we are treated badly so and by treating others good we are saying that we value ourselves enough to not only give love but receive it when it happens to come but we are not limited in our giving ability simply because we don't receive it and that is an act of faith to give love where it might not be given and through faith, we can realize that we are of worth and that we can treat ourselves well, even if we aren't treated well. And by treating ourselves well and of value, even in terrible situations, we are treating ourselves with virtue. And we are being kind to ourselves because it's so easy to be kind to others. It's even harder to be kinder to ourselves. We allow others to treat us badly sometimes and we just take it to heart and then we treat ourselves badly and we need to be kind to ourselves too. It's a great act of faith to show kindness to ourselves because Heavenly Father wants us to treat ourselves with respect even if we aren't respected. And he wants us to show the virtue of kindness even if others are not kind to us. Because there will be a time someday where somebody will show kindness to us. And if we are already being kind, despite the circumstances, it will be easy for us to give and receive. It's our choice, of course. Satan will give us all the reasons in the world that we don't have to be kind to others and be in a pity mode when it comes to a difficult situation or situations we might be in. But you know what? Life's too short to sit on the pity pot. We can be better and we should be better. But it's our choice. But we are very much capable. We just have to believe that in ourselves because Heavenly Father and Jesus already believe that in us. We just have to let go of what holds us back. Utilize the atonement and show our capability by living faith and virtue and that is the best way to remember it and with that said i love you all so very much and i say these things humbly in the name of jesus christ amen